Let's throw it back to a simpler time. Time before the pandemic. A time when there was no balance in Madden whatsoever. A time when for the very first time ever, Madden had abilities. Eric Dickerson ravaged the streets of Madden 20 head to head. Papa Meeg's third girlfriend hadn't yet left him. <laughs> My father hadn't l Whoa, whoa, whoa. And a time when a brand new game mode entered Madden. Now it's funny, I sat down today to record a Draft Champions video. I was gonna go back to the first ever Madden Draft Champions. Well, guess what? They took down the servers of every single Madden all the way up to Madden 20, but Madden 20 is still alive. Now there's so many things to love about Madden 20 and there's so many things to hate too. This game embodied a video game. It did not embody simulation football. There was nothing simulation about Madden 20. X-Factors were broken. Jukebox literally put people on skates like no other. Bulldozer and Freight Train made it look like you were playing against Pee-wee Powder Puff football players. Dashing Deadeye could throw a perfect pass 85 yards downfield. And that's why to this day, Madden 20 was probably my favorite Madden of all time. I know it's not a favorite of many simulation football fans, but I simply don't care. So today we're taking a trip down memory lane and we're playing Madden 20's Superstar KO mode. You know, they really took this mode seriously too. They had all these different game modes within it. They put a bunch of celebrities in the game. DJ Khaled's fat ass was in here. Play as Quavo. I'm trying to remember. There was so much dumb shit. Little Yachty was in the game, I think, for a little bit. Giannis was in here. And now in Madden 23, you can still play it, but they more or less gave up on it. Same with how they gave up on Draft Champions. They, it's almost like they just add things just to sell the game and then completely forget about them. I mean, you're not <laughs> wrong. Now, my favorite team of all time in Superstar KO was always the Magicians. Now, the other awesome thing about Superstar KO is you can keep drafting until you get the team of your choosing. If you guys don't remember Superstar KO or, or any of you are new to my channel, this is what it was. Every single player I draft here, they start the game with their X Factor lit up the entire time. And there's rarities. They range from common, rare, ultra rare, and legendary. So on this board, I've got a common Michael Thomas, rare Mahomes, rare McCaffrey, rare Mari Cooper. As you go up in a rarity, the players get more and more abilities. Common players just have the X Factor. Rare has one ability. Ultra Rare has two or three. And Legendaries can have like five. And like I said, the whole point was it has no fairness aspect at all. There's no simulation football aspect to this shit. It's fucking nonsense. And that's why I love it. Ultra Rare TJ Watt. If I get two Legendaries, I'm good. That's really all I'm aiming for. Oh my god, there's literally one of the best legendaries you can get is Mahomes. Holy shit. I don't know. I might just run with this. Come on, give me something. Give me something. Oh shit, legendary Julio. <laughs> God, Julio had a legendary in this. Holy shit, it's double me Julio too, bro. <laughs> All right, so TJ Watt will come off the edge like a moth. This is insane. Oh my God, his team's fucking cracked. Dude, he's got Travis Scott. Is that Travis Scott? I'm a fucking casual, I guess, but I don't remember who that is. He's got two legendaries, right? So if I beat him, I can steal his players. So I can take one of those two. Ooh, there goes Nick Chubb. We're gonna take him down nice and easy. Nice and easy. It's actually ironic because Patrick Mahomes is the coach of the Magicians team and I also have met quarterback. So I've got two Patrick Mahomes out there. All right, we gotta blitz TJ Watt. Let's see what he goes with here. Might throw halfback. Might throw middle. Ooh, who else? Third and 17. Okay, kinda has to throw to his wide receiver here. If he wants a shot, oh, he's just gonna take a shot deep. Patrick Chung's got it. I actually know if he's still in the lead, but all right, now we got the ball. There are no field goals, but all we gotta go do is score. You're about to witness the power of RPO Peak Zone Ball. Look at Mahomes with the X Factor lit up. We're gonna run the cheesiest play in all of men. You can literally throw this bubble. You can usually throw that bubble just for like money yards on any defense, but you can also give the handoff for, for money yards too. I'll probably throw this to Cook. Let's make the read here. Those blocks are setting up. It's just such a good play. It'd be a lot better if I had an X Factor halfback. So, so we're not gonna hand this off. Julio over the middle. Great catch. Get up. Just hitting this guy with all the RPOs. Yeah, and if you take a look at the abilities here, holy shit. So Mahomes has fucking seven. Every single dead eye in the world, hot route master, escape artist, and Julio Jones has got just an absurd amount of shit. I'll let you guys enjoy that right there. There's not much he can do about this. I'm just gonna go up high to Julio, and he's gotta pray he can stop this. He's running with him. Let's see if he can stop it. Hey, pretty good defense, actually. All right, we're gonna swing him over, and I'm actually just gonna go with the handoff here. Okay, Howard! I, I don't even know who that is. Gonna go half back. Back. Keep it simple. Dalvin Cook. Dalvin Cook right over the middle. Got him. How much more can we get? No. 
No! Dalvin fumbled! No, don't let him return it. Don't you dare let him return it. Go, Mahomes. You have to. Yes! No! Oh! What the fuck? Wait, was that Travis Scott? Oh my god, he's a god. He literally just broke so many fucking tackles. What a loser! Also, you might have noticed the hoodie today. This little guy is Nap Jitsu. Now, to tell you about Nap Jitsu, we got to talk about caffeine. For any of you out there who drink caffeine, coffee, energy drinks, whatever, caffeine gets you wired up, but the crash sucks. So to circumvent that, Nap Jitsu came out with this incredible product here called Nap. Nap is designed to give you the greatest power nap of all time. Now, this is a patent pending energy supplement. So in a nap package are two things. Caffeine pills and your sleep pill. This is just a mint. It helps you fall asleep. It'll get you into your power nap. And then 30 minutes later, the caffeine pills are gonna wake you up with slow time-released caffeine. You have slow release, sustained peak energy throughout the entire day. And if you're just looking for a kick of energy instantly, they also have a now. Same idea, time-released caffeine, but you don't have to power nap. Without a doubt, for sustained optimal energy throughout the day, you guys are gonna wanna check out Nap Jitsu. There's a link in the top of the description. Just click that and enjoy. Enjoy the rest of the video. Hey, I did say one thing at the start of this video though. I said there's not a single piece of this that's simulation football. I think that described it pretty well right there. I'll try a different team now. I'm gonna go Backyard Heroes. They got a ton of just wild plays in this playbook. There is legendary Mahomes, but there's a golden ticket halfback, Adrian Peterson, which is even better. Literally even better. Adrian Peterson, golden ticket halfback. I got an all quarterback crown. It looks like Perk Rogers is gonna be my choice. Having no double me wide receivers is tough, but I think all true rare Travis Kelsey kind of have to go there. Let's just hope my opponent has a legendary on his squad. Wow, and all of my picks were offensive. So that means everybody else will have to be defensive. Oh, he's got golden ticket Taylor Mays. So if we beat him, we take golden ticket Taylor Mays. There's golden ticket Adrian Peterson. Leapfrog, bruiser, running back apprentice, evasive inside zone guru, slotomatic backfield master. So everything. Let's read the read key, make our pitch, get it to Adrian Peterson. Bam. I'm gonna go from this camera angle, cause why not? Hand off to AP? Oh, I wonder if I could've gotten more if I had played that normally. Back in the triple option. Hand off to Juicy Juice. Great block from Travis Kelsey. Good old fashioned read option. Although I'm just basically turning it into, ooh, good move. I'm not going away from the run game. I want this win. I want my Taylor Mays. So I'm not gonna do anything crazy. All right, another read option. Keep it simple. Ooh, daylight, broken tackle. Another broken tackle. Adrian Peterson! Oh, that was disgusting. All right, let's see if we can get to the edge on the two-point. Got to go for two. There's the handoff right up the middle! <laughs> I got met by Taylor Mays, and he has Enforcer. I forgot about that ability. Bro, Enforcer absolutely guarantees a hit-stick tackle, no matter what. Enforcer used to be super broken. You can work around Enforcer in today's game. A lot of pump fakes from Nick Foles, and uh, he just gets sacked. This guy just keeps pump faking. What the fuck am I watching? What the fuck? What, what did I just watch, bro? That guy actually just... All I wanted was my win so I could pick up another player, so I don't really care, but... Taylor Mays, baby! You know we're stealing him. We got our own golden ticket strong safety, Taylor Mays. Let's get it. Holy shit, look at his squad. He's got Quavo, Palomalu, Von Miller. I'm forgetting the white dude. Isn't it like a tight end? The white dude was a tight end. Yeah, it was Dallas Clark, so he's got Migos. Oh, his takeoff. My bad. I'm a fucking casual. He just bombs one up to... Dude, what are you doing? You got you got takeoff on the squad? Sorry, guys. Uh -huh. I don't know my fucking Migos. Cry about it. All right, Perk Rogers hasn't even gotten to throw the ball yet, but... But everybody plays as Dot City, which is what casuals do because you get ran over when you play as Dot City. God, you can run the ball in Dot City literally all day, every day. There is literally no way to stop the run if you choose Dot City. Skirt! Look at how fast that juke is. It's like inhuman. Here we go. I'm going weird camera angle. It's kind of savage, low key. I'll 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 whoop him on any camera angle, bro. I'll get him, I'll get him on this camera angle. Easy game, easy life. Four rushes, 49 yards. I used to say this every time I'd load up a Madden 20 video. I'd say, stop picking Dot City. You're guaranteed a loss if you match up with someone who's going to run the ball. You're just guaranteed a loss. Ooh. Third and five. He made a great play with Palomalo. He can't. Ooh, wait a minute. Wait just a minute. I'm on fourth and four. 
Dude, now we go to overtime. Well, you guys, actually, this is perfect. A lot of you have never watched Superstar KO or don't know this mode. I've never seen Tug of War. We each get three plays. Whoever gets closer or scores a touchdown wins. Let's see what he goes with. He's just gonna heave one up. I respect it, but not on Taylor Mays. I still have Travis Kelsey in the bag, bro. Haven't used him at all. I got Adrian Peterson running around. He's definitely in zone. Oh, shit, he's not in zone. Well, that's okay, because I got double me. So I picked up Kelsey, baby. Ooh, good throw. Taylor Mays is there, though. Hey, nice pickup right there. Oh, it's actually five plays. Damn, it used to be three. If you get to the green zone, you end the game. I might just have to throw a heave Travis Kelsey. If Kelsey's not there, I'm looking Adrian Peterson. Kelsey? Kelsey down a seam? I should have racked that ball. I got to rack catch that ball, not... That works. Let's go, Roby Coleman. No, wrong way. Wait, you savage. You savage, Roby Coleman. Let's go. Lil Yachty, the backyard heroes in our squad. It's going to catch a dub here, and I can only get defense, actually, so I can only take Troy Palomalu here. Damn, I was actually given so many options. There's legendary Strahan and legendary Mel Blunt, but obviously the move is, is golden ticket Troy P, baby. Damn, that's so sick. Golden ticket Anthony Barr, legendary Erlacher, legendary Marcus Allen. That Marcus Allen's scary. Then Jalen Ramsey, George Kittle. He has no quarterback. If you win the game when you have six players, that's how you win Superstar K. Yo, I got to catch my dub here. Going up against Jared Poverty Goff. But really what I'm going up against is this Marcus Allen. He just tried to hurdle me. I'm on Kittle. He's got nothing. Look who gets to him. None other than Taylor Mays. Third and 22. Nice play. Go get him. Go get him. Let's go, boys. Fourth and 22. He's going to throw contested to Muhammad Sanu. If that was somebody who would double me, I might have been worried. But he's not going to be able to get that. Muhammad Sanu goes down. Backyard heroes are back out. With none other than Adrian Peterson back here. Gonna run one over. Oh, yeah. There we go. Get the pitch. Let's get it. Well played. Great juke. I'm gonna go hat back power. Oh, he's seen so much of everything else that hopefully this has some yards on it. With a broken tackle, it does. Juke inside. AP. Anything's possible if you break every fucking tackle that comes across. There's play action. There's Kelsey. Oh, I could have gone real bad. Oh, there's Kelsey in a window. Nice bullet. Four for four, Perk Rogers. Perk Rogers. Perk Rogers roll out. Perk Rogers roll out. Pylon. Off to Perk 90. That's a big dub. It's not a Perk 30, baby. It's a Perk 90. Let's go. Oh. I can take the golden ticket outside linebacker Anthony Barr. I have to take that over Erlacher. I do like Erlacher, but the golden tickets are so much better. All right, boys, we get the dub here. We get the, the full dub. We cannot dub up any harder. <sighs> Piss poor poverty. Damn, it was, we were really that close to it. Off the dome piece, play one. We can. Tutty, 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 tutty. No way. I thought Perk Rogers could do that. Well, it's tug of war on the final game. He's got B-Doc, Night Train, and Bar. Okay, well, I like our defense to start the game out. All right, I probably <laughs> dropped it. David Montgomery dropped that. Yikes. This isn't as good of a play call. That's actually pretty damn good defense, dude. Big hit! Ooh, I fucking lit him up. Wait, did he drop that? I hit him so hard he dropped it. I didn't realize he dropped it at first. All right, when we're running this way, though, we're only running towards night train lane. So I think that's good. We just got to get to the outside. Yes, sir. Juke inside. Yes, sir. Damn. He just wants to go Mike Evans. Oh, bad. Wait, what? Why didn't you animate on that? Because I've ran so much with Adrian Peterson. We got to hope that he actually bites on this. He doesn't. We do make the throw to Emmanuel Sanders. Hard cut inside of Dawkins. Ah, there's no hard cut in this game. What the fuck am I talking? talking about amazing play we needed that so bad huge gain he's backed up into his own territory he's got to get a massive play here he's got to hit mike evans again does he run the same play oh he's got mike evans across the middle big hit and he drops it again let's go i only need a yard i need one yard built for this come on let's go <laughs> that's it baby damn that got so Ooh, that was nerve-wracking. Emmanuel Sanders ended up making a play, too. I just went undefeated, I believe. Undefeated champs with an absolutely cracked squad. I missed this game, man. All right, boys. I thought I'd throw back, and this was, wow, trip down memory lane. This was one of the most fun times I've had. Play mad in a hot minute. I tell you what. All right, boys. I love you. Thanks for watching, as always. And, of course, I will see you in the next video. Peace.